Hey everybody, it's your girl Sincerely Dree, and I'm back today with another video. So, as I've seen tied down below, today we are in Brumby Hall. This is one of the newly renovated dorm buildings that we have on campus and this is one of our high rises that is only first year so today i'm actually about to be in here moving in staying in here for the week so i'm going to show you all kind of what it looks like in here and kind of what your room could look like in here so we just came from the elevators there are four elevators the elevators are actually kind of a little small but you know you'll get past it but we have the water machines over here with your filtered water bottles as well and then there are four wings. Here's the west wing, the east wing is over there, and then we have the north and the south that we're actually about to get to real quick. Um, they do have a lot of study rooms in here, you guys can kind of see. So I'm just gonna show y'all a little bit of that before we get to the room. Okay, right, we're back real quick, but that is the east. Here are some of the phone rooms, study rooms. So as you can tell, there are a lot of study, phone rooms, everything that you need inside of this building. And they actually have a little kitchen area over here as well. But they do have full kitchens on other levels. So I'm gonna take y'all to what y'all actually came here for, the room. So let's get to the room real quick. And here is my room for the week, I'm a 202 and don't mind all the stuff but when you first come to the room this is kind of what it's gonna look like you have your people this door is a very heavy door so it's not gonna be able to stay open without putting something in the way but here is what a room looks like inside of brumby so as y'all can see kind of the normal standard you have your one bunk bed on this side along with your movable side desk and a regular desk and you have a roller chair which is pretty convenient as well and then you have these stairs which y'all if i had this first year i would have been amazing so you could just step up on these stairs and actually get into your bed which like i said is very convenient and then they all have this sort of closet thing as well which can also be moved so when you come here you could basically move everything here is just a little window and another window over there. The AC actually comes from up here, but here, it's basically the same thing on both sides. Here is the other closet. Here are your stairs as well. So you can see like this side had the stairs like that, while this side had the stairs like this. So you can really place it any type of way. And this right here is to strap it on to the side of your bed so like it doesn't move around if you want to. And then like I said on this side, same thing you have your bed your desk your side desk and you have your roller chair and also these twin beds are also able to move as well so you can put it all the way down to the bottom or you can put it all the way up to the top and then you have this as well so you know you don't fall over anything like that other than that the only other thing that they have is of course your ac is in here and then you have your light switch over there. So as you can see, it's not that much space, but it's just a little something something. Also, if you're kind of like me and you have a lot of electronics, there are two little outlets right there, along with two outlets on this side. And if I'm not mistaken, I believe that those are the only ones. Well, no, there are two more over here. And then on this side, you have your cable connector and there might actually be some behind that as well so if you are staying in Burnley that is something to note that you do want to bring extra outlets your power strips everything that you're probably going to need to make sure you could charge all of your devices so I'm actually going to get into moving my stuff in packing my stuff in if y'all want to see what I'm going to be doing in this building for this week make sure you subscribe and from patient bell because I'm actually doing a camp this week in here so stay tuned for that and also make sure that you follow me on Instagram at I'm Steve Drew because of course I'm going to talk with y'all way more often on there because I'm on there way more often than YouTube. And remember that I love you all so, 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 so much. And my name is Steve Drew and I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye.